Okay, Cam Taylor, Britt, has joined us. Uh, Brian Christofferson, 24-7 Sports. Hey, Cam, you guys played 91 plays on defense. Did it did it feel like that at the end? Were you tired? What, what was it like those last couple series? Yeah, I say towards the end of the game, you know, it started to take a toll on us. But, you know, once they, you know, call their timeouts and, you know, we got a little bit of, you know, just a sip of water. That's all we need, you know, just keep it on going. But, you know, I feel like we were fine towards the end of that game. You know, we know we, we wanted to be the ones to finish the game off, and, and we did that. Um, Andy Kendi. Yeah, um, so many times you guys have been in these close games. What was the difference today to get over the hump and win one of these? We had a great week of practice, first off. You know, that's where it begins at, you know, Monday through, you know, through Friday until we get that Saturday. And we, we have to understand that, you know, we have to we, – we put in all this work for what, you know. Uh, the defense, we had a great week. You know, for us to go out there, you know, and play like that, that's how we're supposed to play. You know, they expect that of us. But if we go out there, you know, have, you know, bull, you know, during the week, you know, it's going to be bad on the weekend. So we just have to come together, man, and all play together as one. Lincoln Journal Star, Parker Gabriel. Hey, Cam, I think on a second to last drive that it was four straight, either pass breakups or uh, passes defensed, and then they kept coming after you on the last drive. What does it say about your group and, and that veteran group you guys have in the secondary to stand up to that, that challenge? Man, we love challenges. Man. You know, we, we feel like, you know, as the defense, the DBs, you know, on our back end, we feel like, you know, uh, everything is on us. You know, if something breaks loose, we have to be there. You know, if they throw the ball in there, we have to be there. And we really just take pride in that. You know, uh, like I said, we had a great week of practice, man. That's what's supposed to happen on game day. Andrew Ward, KLKN. Hey, Cam, what's going through your mind? You know, first and goal, you guys are clinging to a, a seven-point a seven lead there at the end of the game. Ah, uh, well, I just know one thing, lock my side of the field up. <laughs> Uh, no, nah, really just lock in, man. Uh, let all the distractions go, play, you know, play loose and just relax, you know, have fun out there, but, you know, stay locked in. And I just felt like, you know, it was on us and we wanted it to be on us, like I said. So, you know, just lock my side of the field down. Uh, three more here for Cam. Sean Callahan. Yeah, Cam, um, how angry were guys just after the way you lost last week? And how did that kind of transfer over to your preparations and how you played out there today? Well, I can say I was one of the ones that was mad last week. Um, I've been three years. And for us to, you know, continue to do that, it, I, you know, it's just very frustrating. You know, I'm a, I'm a true junior now, and I've seen everything that we've done here. And we, we get up and we get right back down because, you know, we get comfortable. And what we were just telling, you know, the guys on the sideline is, you know, don't get comfortable. We have, it's 0-0 zero, zero again. We, we were up 27 to, you know, 6 or whatever. And I was just like, man, it's 0-0. Zero, zero. We have to play a full game all over again. Let's go out here and fight to the end. Mitch Sherman, The Athletic. Hey, Cam, how can you guys build on this so that you do – more of what you were just talking about so that the team does play more like it's zero zero when when you're up by three touchdowns how, how do you build on this going forward to make that happen and we just have to play as a team when we play together i, I don't believe anything can stop us man uh, we, we tend to beat ourselves in some situations you know we may not communicate or something or may miss an assignment you know that's very key and may end up in a touchdown uh, we just try to you know hone in on those things and you know make sure everybody's on the same page We'll finish up here uh, for Cam with um, Sam McEwen. Hey, Cam. Um, they have a really, really good receiver in Dotson, and you guys held him to two catches for 27 yards today. What was the plan against him? Why did you guys have so much success? Uh, we just, you know, really focused on him during the week, uh, during film study, during practice. We had, you know, some young guys, you know, imitate, you know, the things that he does at receiver. Uh, just so we can, you know, get used to it. We felt like, you know, when he when he slows down, just go ahead and get on it right now because he, he has that speed to, you know, stack and get on top of you and make those big plays. So we just want to stay on top of him, man. All right. Let's have emulating him in practice. Uh, we had uh, – uh, who do we have? <laughs> we call him Peanut. <laughs> oh, Demarion. Yeah, Demarion, Houston.
Yeah, you know, he's a fast guy, uh, track guy. So we just really want to, you know, and it, it makes us better, I feel. You know, with him, you know, running full speed, everything, uh, it makes us, you know, you know, really stick to what we know. All right. Thank you, Cam. Uh, we will um, – we're expecting Ben Stilley and JoJo Doman. We'll put one on either of the two Zooms as they come up.